everyone welcome back to random things in today's video i'm going to be telling you how to make a 2d shape to a 3d shape in powerpoint in a very simple way so without wasting any time let's begin so over here i'm going to be inserting a new shape you can find it uh, the shapes in the home option the as well as in the uh, shapes option so over here we are gonna choose any shape i'm using the circle and then just double click in the shape to add a text box and then uh, you can even add text or you can uh, do it without the text so i'm adding the text shape now i'm uh, duplicating it so copy uh, you you can either press the control v option on your keyboard or the paste option in the home tab uh, so i have clicked the paste option and there we go so let's start by changing the font so uh, first we need to select uh, the text and over here i have already used the cooper black so you can uh, find it in the all fonts or over here you can just type it cooper black so it will automatically show you that option and just press enter so i have uh, used the cooper black option and now let's start editing the shape so first i'll change the color over here we have the option of shape uh, shape fill then over here i have the option of gradient go to more gradients and just below the solid fill well it's uh, selected by default just below that there is the option of gradient fill just click there then these are the colors that we are, uh, i have used you can choose any there are uh, so there are sometimes four there's sometimes five so if you are having four or five of them then uh, you can delete those by either clicking the uh, remove one or if you want to add you can just click this option of add gradient so we don't really need it so we are going to be removing them now I have uh, put the gradient fill over there and then shape outline. I don't want any outline so I'll just click on no outline. Uh, then we have the option of uh, shape effect. Over here we have the option of preset. Then just choose any of them. I'm choosing this preset well and over here we have the option of 3d rotation shadow reflection glow soft edges be well and 3d rotation so i'll be using off axis to top you can use any of them okay so we are done here you can also see that there are shadows forming over here and over here it's like it's really glossy so that's it for today if you like the video please like and subscribe thanks for watching